Hi Virgo, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your weekly tarot forecast for the week of July 18th through the 24th. This is for Virgo Sun, Virgo Moon, and Virgo Rising signs. Alright Virgo, so at the bottom of the deck I do have the Eight of Cups, okay. So the Eight of Cups is forward movement. For some Virgos, uh, you certainly could be moving to a new home. This is looking to the future, leaving the past behind and just looking to the future, looking forward. Uh, it's a very positive energy. Uh, for some of you, maybe you're physically moving, you could be physically moving or traveling, and then for others, this is you maybe moving forward with your life in some way. Because the overall energy is the Four of Wands for the entire week, which is amazing. Um, this is my happy home card. Uh, certainly some Virgos might be actually moving to a new home. Um, moving towards maybe more security or stability coming into your life. Um, for many Virgos, you could be certainly spending a lot of time with your family this week. This is overall a very happy, um, happy, extremely positive energy. Uh, so you might be spending a lot of time with the family, spending a lot of time within your home. Maybe you're doing some projects around the house. Uh, and then some other Virgos, you know, you certainly could be moving to a new home. Um, or moving towards more stability. Uh, we are starting out with justice. So justice can represent contracts. For some Virgos, maybe you received an offer because I also have the Knight of Pentacles here. You could have received maybe an offer for a job. You could be signing a contract uh, this week, Virgo. Justice can represent that karmic justice, contracts. This can also represent legal decisions or just decisions in general. Um, for some Virgos, you could... You know, you could be, because I also have the Five of Pentacles here, diagonal uh, from Justice here. This can represent feeling down and out, losing faith with something. So maybe because we have the Knight of Pentacles here, who is a slower moving knight. And when we see the Knight of Pentacles, you know, we know that it's, it's a bit of a process. He does represent a forward moving energy, but he is a slower paced forward moving energy. And he is moving towards this, this justice. He's moving towards justice, moving towards this contract or moving towards this decision, moving towards this divorce, um, something legal. You might have been slowly but surely moving towards this. So some Virgos, you certainly might be starting to maybe lose lose faith with this because maybe it's taking so long um, with the Knight of Pentacles. Again, it's a it's a bit of a process, um, but justice will be served. You are literally walking towards justice, Virgo. This is going to happen. Uh, it just might be a, a bit of a process for some Virgos. Um, yeah, maybe you need this decision um, that allows you to walk down a new, new path because I also have the Fool here which represents you walking down a new path in life. It just requires you taking some sort of risk or leap of faith. Um, yeah, and I feel like that's why we have this Five of Pentacles, which is losing faith, feeling down and out, feeling a lack with something. For some of you, uh, maybe you've been waiting on a decision or waiting to be able to take this leap of faith. Um, but you are slowly but surely moving towards this this yes, moving towards this decision, moving towards this contract. Um, the Knight of Pentacles is the only knight who's always successful. So it's because he's he's very methodical. He's he's very cautious. He's a slower moving knight, you know. And because of that, he he can plan out the details. He can you know think about the steps that he's taking before he takes them he's the only knight who always is successful and always reaches his goal so you're going to reach your goal Virgo you're moving towards justice here you just have to keep the faith um we also have the empress here so this is amazing energy so the empress is that very blessed energy that um 
for some of you, if you are starting a project, signing a contract, starting a new job, or buying a home, I would say this is blessed. This is surrounded by extremely blessed energy. The Empress is that very fertile energy. Uh, for some Virgo women, if you've been trying to conceive, um, you know, give it a go this week because this is some great energy. Um, for others, you know, this could be you being incredibly fertile with creative ideas, um, being incredibly creative, maybe coming up with, um, you know, different creative plans and ideas for yourself. And anything that is started while we have the energy of the Empress present, it will be incredibly rewarding for you. So if you're a Virgo who's moving to a new home or starting a new job, um, yeah, this is really surrounded by blessed energy. Um, but what's interesting is diagonal from the Empress, we have death which represents transformation, great change, endings and new beginnings. So for some Virgos, maybe um, something in your life has ended, but um, you know, with that ending, you are creating that space within your life for something new to come in. Um, with death, there's always a new beginning. So for some Virgos, this certainly can be you, you know, leaving a home behind because you're moving to a new home. Um, maybe you're uh, leaving a job for another job. I do have the King of Wands here looking directly at death. And for some of you, this might be your energy. Maybe you're more fiery and ambitious this week. Uh, quite creative, passionate. Um, you know, I see a lot of Virgos being incredibly creative. But also, um, there could be some that, that are also very methodical, um, very detail-oriented. And the King of Wands, for me, represents taking action. So for some Virgos, this is you literally taking action, being quite uh, passionate and ambitious with something, uh, definitely wanting to maybe end something, uh, wanting to start something new. Um, I also have the Page of Wands here. So this can represent really, really exciting communication coming through. And normally for me with the Page of Wands, it's communication or information that you've been waiting on. So for some Virgos, um, you know, you're, you're definitely receiving a message or getting that communication that maybe you've been waiting on. Um, and this communication can actually, you know, bring about great change. Maybe this is communication that you've been waiting on. Um, yeah, communication that brings about this great change, this great transformation. Um, and that's why we have the Eight of Cups at the bottom of the deck, because you are literally uh, moving forward, Virgo. For some of you, you're walking down a new path, taking, taking a risk or taking some sort of leap of faith. Um, for, for other Virgos, you could certainly have a Scorpio person or maybe even a fire sign person or even a Libra uh, present in your life or someone who's very significant um, in your life this week, Virgo. But overall, I see it just honestly being an amazing week. For some of you, I think you might be feeling a little down, losing faith um, with something. Uh, maybe because it's been taking a little bit of time, but you are slowly but surely, um, you know, approaching justice. You will reach your goal, Virgo. Um, for some of you, that can be a decision, a contract, a divorce. Um, for some of you, it's marriage. Maybe you've been maybe maybe you've been trying to tie the knot. So for some of you, this certainly can be marriage with the Four of Wands and justice here. Uh, if you've been trying to conceive, definitely give it a go this week because you have this amazing energy around you with the Empress. Um, yeah, and I think that honestly, overall, it's going to be just a great week for you, Virgo. So let me draw you an additional guidance card. All right, so this is the card. Archangel Gabriel, you have an important life purpose involving communication and the arts. Please don't allow insecurities to hold you back. I will help you. Very nice. So if you're feeling uh, insecure or having doubts this week, Virgo, um, you need to know that you're surrounded by that beautiful divine energy. 
uh, and your angels angels are definitely going to be helping you this week you have an important life purpose involving communication and the arts please don't allow insecurities to hold you back I will help you so very nice Virgo I think that honestly overall it's going to be a great week I do hope that you enjoyed this reading take care